Hey guys, and welcome back for another video. Before we even get started, I just want to say that I do apologize, but I lost quite a bit of the footage for this particular video, and as a result, I won't be able to show you the physical eggs themselves, and instead will be jumping my character up and down in the location of each egg. Today, I'd like to help you gather all 21 eggs required for the Skyscale Eggs achievement, and this will complete the Newborn Skyscales collection. Like previous guides, I'll be trying to cut down on waypoints whenever possible. And again, to make these guides as accessible as possible, we'll only be using the core pathifier mounts, and we will use some of the free sky scales to get around some of the gliding and or griffin use that you might otherwise use. After completing the previous collection, do make sure that you return to Gorik and talk to him so that you can unlock the sky scale eggs collection. And to grab your first egg, it'll again be just on the cliff right next to where you spoke with Gorik. From here, head to the Underworld Waypoint. From the Waypoint, head south, and you'll be jumping up the same way you usually head when you're heading to Gorik, only this time we'll be heading up a large statue, and you'll just want to use your Springer Mount to get up those cliffs. And all the way on top of the statue, near the crown area, you'll find your next egg. Switch to your skimmer and fall down northwest off of the statue. And you'll just want to head west, hugging the right wall, falling down towards some blue magic, and continuing northwest. Continue until you see a path open to the north and take that path. Soon after, you'll want to make an immediate left turn and then straighten yourself out by turning right. On your left hand side you should see a stone arch and you just need to switch to your springer and jump up on that arch. Jump onto the platform to the south and continue using your springer to get to the other side of that platform where you should see your next egg. Next you need to climb back up onto that platform and you can use your springer to do so and then you'll want to switch immediately to your jackal. To the north, you should see a jackal portal, and you just need to take that portal. Through the portal, you should see some rocks in front of you, and you'll just need to head over, switch to your springer, and jump up on the ledge. On your left-hand side, you'll see a few rocks, and you'll just want to jump up on those rocks with your springer, and then use your springer to get to the next highest platform to the north. Once on top, just follow that platform to the west until it just about dead ends, and right next to some rocks and a pillar, you should see your next egg. On the ledge you just came from, you should see a sky scale, so just jump down and grab that sky scale, immediately start gaining some altitude and heading north. After a short while, things will open up and you can begin heading northwest, and we're headed towards the other landmass with an outstretched tree branch. As you approach that tree branch, do use your disengage ability on the sky scale to lower yourself slowly as you make your way, and just past that tree branch on a rocky platform below, you should see your next egg. Now we need the Burning Forest Waypoint, and just to the west of that waypoint, if you get on your Springer, you can jump up on a tree branch. Follow that tree branch to the northwest until you reach a new platform, and continue until you see some rocks you can jump up on. Use those rocks to jump up even higher to another nearby tree branch, and it's on that branch that you should see your next egg. Switch to your skimmer and jump off of that tree branch heading towards the outer perimeter of the map. At first you can use a couple of ledges until you straighten out to head north. And when you run out of ledges, just free fall down on your skimmer until you reach the water. From here, you just need to follow the outside perimeter of the map, looking to the right or the landmass, 
and just before the outer perimeter of the map meets up with the edge of the map itself, you should see on your right hand side a rocky ledge where you can grab your next egg. Head back to the Underworld Waypoint and this time we'll be headed southeast out of the camp. After a short distance you should see some burning bushes with some rocks you can use your springer to jump up on. After a few ledges you'll reach a new platform and that platform has a jackal portal so switch to your jackal and head through the portal. On the other side of the portal just head east and on your left hand side you'll see a tree and it's right inside of that tree that you'll see your next egg. Now we need the pack command waypoint and from that waypoint we just want to take the middlemost path. Follow that path until just after the bridge and you'll want to switch to your springer. To the right you should see some rocks you can jump up on and once on top just head west until you see another large rock that you can again use your springer to get a little bit higher. On this rock you should see a sky scale and we need to grab that sky scale. Gain altitude with your sky scale and make your way west and make sure you give yourself time to land on one of the branded crystals so that you can go up a little bit higher. From the branded crystal you should head south towards the next highest platform and it's actually just on that platform that you'll find your next egg. Now you can get on your skimmer and make your way west towards Krakatorik's body. You'll actually want to use the skimmer to make it to Krakatorik's body and just beyond his body you'll see a ledge with a tree branch. Switch to your springer and jump up on the next highest ledge. And once on top you should see several ledges as well as a tree that you can use to get to the very highest platform. Once you do make it to the top just head south towards some nearby rocks and it's right at the base of those rocks that you'll find your next egg. From here get on your skimmer and head north back off of the platform. Just below you there's a path you can follow to the west and you'll want to follow that path to the west until you see a sky scale on your right hand side. This will be on a lower ledge and you'll need to drop down and once you have your sky scale just gain altitude back onto the platform you just came from and start heading north. After a while you should see a far off platform just beyond some tree branches and you just want to use your sky scale to navigate around those tree branches and onto that platform. On this next platform you'll see some trees and near the roots of those trees you should see your next egg. Now we'll need Melandru's Lost Domain Waypoint and you'll just want to head west from the waypoint until the path splits and then you'll want to follow the left or the southernmost path just about until it dead ends. To the northwest you'll see several cliffs you can jump up on and you'll just want to use your springer to get all the way up until you're at the second highest platform. Once on top just look for the highest platform in a nearby tree and directly in between the tree and that platform on the outside edge you should see your next egg. Now switch to your springer and actually jump up on the highest platform. Once on top you do want to switch to your skimmer and just before that platform dead ends to the north, use your skimmer to fall off the right hand side. Continue to fall on your skimmer until you reach the ground and head northeast until you see a northbound road. Follow that for just a second but keep your eye on the left hand side as in between two trees you should see an opening. Through that opening you'll see some tree roots you can jump up and if you followed my previous guides you're probably more than familiar with this area. 
Use those tree roots to make it to the next highest cliff. And then somewhat hidden in some shrubs, you can continue to use some platforms on the nearby tree to make it to the next highest ledge. Once on top, you should see a flat platform surrounded by two tree branches, and we just need to jump up onto that platform. Of the two branches sticking out of that platform, one should splinter off in two, and you'll just need to use your springer to jump up where those two branches meet for your next egg. Switch back to your skimmer and fall off to the northeast. Once you reach the ground, you may want to switch to a faster mount, and you'll just be following the road for a while as it heads northwest. Continue over the bridge, and just past that bridge on your left hand side you should see an opening that you'll want to take. Through the opening you'll just want to continue to head west until you see a sky scale on a ledge, and you'll just need to use your springer to jump up to that sky scale. With your sky scale, gain some altitude, and you may need to land once in order to get all the way up. But if you head north, you should see a large tree. And if you continue north enough, you should see that that tree has a small platform you can land on. And we'll be using that platform to jump up just a little bit higher to our next egg. Get on your skimmer, and you'll want to head southwest from the branches towards some nearby ledges. Once on the ledges, switch to your springer and jump all the way up all the ledges. Once on top, to your right hand side, you should see a tree, and you want to head towards that tree, staying towards its left side. And on a platform just below, you should see a rock, and right next to that rock, you'll see your next egg. Head back to Melandru's Lost Domain Waypoint, and this time we'll be leaving the camp through the north. As soon as you leave the camp, immediately make a right, and you just want to follow that path until you see an opening on your left hand side next to a large tree. Follow that back using your springer to climb up on some platforms. And continuing in that same direction, on your right hand side you should see an outstretched tree branch that you can use your springer to jump up on and grab your next egg. From here just get on your springer and you'll want to head west sticking towards the right hand side. And near a tree you should see some roots you can jump up on with your springer. And on those roots you should see an even higher tree branch that you can jump up on from there. Once more, you'll need to use your springer to jump on an outstretched branch covered in leaves, and it's on that branch that you'll see your next egg. From here, you'll want to get back on your springer, and you'll actually want to head back to that branch you just jumped off of to grab your last egg. From here, you'll just want to use your springer to jump up the tree branches and make it as high as you can go. Take your time and be patient as jumping up these tree branches can be a little bit awkward, and once you make it to the highest possible point, directly to the north you should see a high up platform. Switch to your skimmer mount and you should be able to make that cliff from the highest point. On the other side you just want to follow the path past two trees, and when you meet your third tree right at the base of that tree you'll find your next egg. Now you just want to head east for a while, and you should see another sky scale as well as Krakatorik's wing. Use the sky scale to get over to Krakatorik's wing. And you'll just want to follow the wing to the north until it just about dead ends. From here I'd recommend switching to your springer, 
and you'll just want to jump all the way up until you see some green grass. Once on top, you should see a couple of rocky ledges with a tree on top, and you'll just want to head to the base of that tree for your next egg. Next, you'll want to grab the nearby sky scale, and we'll be using that sky scale to fall through the hole near Krakatorik's wing. Right away, you should see some green rocky platforms on the left hand side, and you'll just want to head to those platforms with your sky scale. Follow those cliffs back to the south until they dead end next to some flowers, and just on the other side of those flowers you'll find your next egg. Now you can get on your skimmer and follow the rest of the way down Krakatorik's wing until you reach the waters below. From the water, continue to head northeast, and you should see an opening to a cove with a statue. On the right hand side of that cove, you'll see several rocky ledges you can jump up. So just use your springer to jump up on those ledges, and on top, you should see your last and final egg. Once you've gathered all 21 eggs, head back to Gorik in the same location he's been for the previous collections and make sure you talk to him to complete not only Skyscale eggs, but newborn Skyscales. To anyone out there still trying to gather these eggs or wrap up the newborn Skyscale collection, I hope you found this helpful. Again, I do apologize for the footage in not being able to actually show the eggs, but I think this should still help someone trying to get all 21. As always guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.